أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم ما لكل ملك الله سبحانه وتعالى within the 84th name within the asma al husna is being described as malikul mulk meaning the owner of all sovereignty or the eternal possessor of sovereignty allah subhanahu wa ta'ala the one who controls the dominion and gives dominion to whoever he willed allah is malikul mulk the lord of the kingdom he is the sole owner of all creation with absolute authority he can act in any manner, any time, and in any way. It has been said that the recitation of the name Malikul Mulk, whoever recites this name, inshaAllah, they will get esteem. Malikul Mulk has also been mentioned in the Holy Quran, where Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, He alone is the all knowing creator. His being alone is such that when He wills a thing to be, but He but says unto it, Be and it is, Kun Fayakun, limitless. Then in his glory is he in whose hands rests the mighty dominion over all things. And unto him you all will be brought back. And this is in Surah Yasin. So we, we should we should it is important to note over here that when Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says that in his glory in is he in whose hand rests, it is not talking about a literal hand. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in this some ulama have interpreted it as just for our understanding so that we don't get misguided. Allah, uh, some ulama have interpreted it as Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala referring to his power and his might. So instead of in his glory is he in whose hand rests the mighty dominion, it should it has been interpreted as in his glory is he in whose power rests the mighty dominion over all things. So Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala he is Malikul Mulk, the eternal possessor and of sovereignty. So he is in total control of everyone who is in control of us and everything else within creation. For that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala allows us to see the amount of bounty and mercy that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has blessed with us so that we are, have been born with Iman. And I pray that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala allows us to, by seeing this, be, by being grateful to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala I pray that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala allows this to be a means for our entrance into Jannah Ameen